Uh, hi everyone, this is attorney Ayhan Agmin. So can I change my uh, J1 work and travel status to F1 status after I'm in the US? And will this be a hard thing or will it be possible or not to change my status to F1? Once you're in the US, you came with your J1 work and travel uh, visa and you started your program and you stay in touch with your consultant from the work and travel organization and then you stay in touch with your sponsor and you do work at, your, at the location that it was provided to you. And if you are following that, it's important because you have to first maintain your status in the US and that will be work and travel uh, program. Once you do that, once you start your program and 90 days after your entry to the US, and while you're in still good standing of your work and travel status, then yes, you're going to be able to change your status to F1 status to be able to stay in the US. So what's important first, you have to maintain your work and travel program status by continuing your program. Second, after 90 days of your entry, you're going to locate the school that you want to go and you're going to get an I-20 from them. Then you're going to file for change of status to USCIS uh, and then wait for their approval then you will start your educational program. So that's the first part of the question to this follower. And second part, will this be harder? Well, it has been harder with this new administration in the US. And it, like in the last one and a half year, it has been very tough. Uh, and there are a bunch of denials that students received. So what will be done is what's important that you make sure that you work with an attorney, a lawyer, to change your status rather than trying by yourself or trying to get a school to do for you or someone to fill up your application you definitely need a legal help and that's what's needed now because in the last one and a half years so many things has been changing for change of status and of course change of status to have fun it has become tough but it's not impossible it's important that you follow those steps you make sure that your lawyer does the good job and follow the change of status and actually follows it. So that will be my answer to this follower.